Hey everybody, welcome back to Model Car Madness. I want to show you something I'm working on here. This is something I've never tried before. Uh, let's see if I can get this camera positioned. I'm trying to make my own four link. Um, what I did was I, I took a the four link from the Ravel Pro Sportsman kit, which kind of goes together like this. I mean, I got a bunch of these and I use them for most every drag car that I build. But um, I got a scratch building project here of a 39 Willys coupe. And I, after starting out with the cutting down a pro stock chassis and not having a whole lot of luck with it and not being real satisfied with it, I decided to scratch build the chassis. Kind of copied the front of that monogram pro stock chassis with this. You know, kind of patterned it after that and then made my own kick up in the back but now needing a, a rear suspension I was going to use the pro stock kit you know four link and rear but that's not really working out I mean it looks okay but nothing fits it's it's distorted and twisted it's put together the way it's supposed to go but it's just not quite working out so I decided to try rather than use up a, one of my four links from the pro sportsman kit and then have be short a rear suspension all the time so i took some some sheet styrene it's about sixty thousandths thick and what i did i put tape on it to mark it out and just kind of traced out the brackets the front and the back bracket cut them out and then i took um actually used the front cross piece from the pro sportsman chassis and drilled it and pinned it so what we got here if you can see it that's the front bar and what I drilled drilled a little hole into there put a straight pin in or a piece of a straight pin drill a little hole into this put a piece of straight pin and then the rear brackets I have two put together right now I'm holding them with the wire until I get the hole bigger this way I could sand them try to keep them symmetrical you know from side to side but I drilled and pinned that so this goes in like this I can't see really but yeah so it'll be like that which is a similar copy to the Ravel so I'll drill the back side here to put a wheelie bar in. I still have to drill the top for the top bar. And then I'll have to make some coilovers to put in the, on the back. And then I'll drill the lightning holes back there that are in this. Drill the hole bigger for the rear housing. And I have a competition resins 9 inch Ford rear. that I'll slip into that. And hopefully everything works out. And I'll have my own homemade four link rear suspension. So I'll keep you updated on that as it goes along. And since I got the camera out anyway, I'll show the, the Glidden, the Glidden Pino chassis is coming along. Motor's in. I did have to add here be, to the wheel tub because when, I, when the body's in, it had a, a gap here, which I didn't like. So I'll trim that off, paint that silver, and then that'll match up. But I don't need to put the body on now. But you can see I made the, the steering support in there like I usually do. And the, theoretically the steering shaft will run right through there and line up where it's supposed to line up. So I'm making, making some progress on things. Oh, and this Willys is going to have these old style slot wheels on it. And it's going to be yellow. Um, I was thinking like a real, like a chrome, what they call chrome yellow. But I also have some, some nice, um, if I can find it. Yeah, I think this is it. Yeah, I have some, some gravity paint. This is Lamborghini. It's like a pearl yellow. It's, it's a really nice color. I used it on a Fiat one time. And I think maybe I'm going to use it on this Willys unless I get to the hobby store and find another yellow that I like better. But I do want it yellow after seeing a picture of a yellow one on the internet. It's just 
I really like it. So that's what it's going to be. Okay, after about an hour, maybe an hour and a half of uh, cutting and drilling and pinning, I got the reproduction four link finished except for coilovers, which I'll have to make. But I don't know ride height of this car, so I don't know the length of the coilovers yet. But it fits together on the Competition Resins rear housing. And there it is. And here's the, uh, the Revell next to it. They're not 100% you know, identical, but they're pretty good. It's pretty good. And I think the length of it, length of the bars might be a little bit longer, which it's not much, if anything, and it may work out better on the wheelies anyway, that way. So I'm pretty happy with that. Once it gets painted and detailed a little bit, it'll look good. Okay. Thanks for watching.